Every city is unique in Shanghai, especially. It's all a really open city. It's a cultural city. It's a city of innovation. Yeah, it, every week it looks different. Every week <laughs> something new is coming up. So it's an exciting um, city to be at moments like this. I'm head of the Department for Culture and Education here in Shanghai. There are a lot of really big cultural institutions here, so we cannot compete with them. So for us, it's really important to have a small scale and also alternative program to do this. So we have this small room, which fits 100 to 150 people, and try to show things which you perhaps normally don't see everywhere in this city. Hello. Um, for the digital concert for two weeks. Do you mean it's possible that we don't show the whole concert, but we can have one topic, for example? We need smaller parts of 10 or 15 minutes, okay. so um, we always show something and talk about it, show the second mm -hmm. thing. Uh, music is really on the top <laughs> of the cultural list in Shanghai and there are really, really good um, institutions here. But I think the difference here is um, that we given an open access to everyone. You don't have to um, buy expensive tickets, uh, which are normally sold out quite fast. It's uh, the same problem in, in Berlin, probably all over the world with really the big houses and the really famous orchestras. So it's interesting to offer also this experience of really high class music um, to people who are music lovers, who perhaps study music, which are really involved to it, but normally don't have the access. Music is emotional, you can see it, you can hear it, and it's already something um, which enriches you. But uh, especially if you have the possibility to hear more, to understand a little bit more, to have a background on it, uh, to, to talk with others, to ask questions, you can talk with each other, you can discuss it. I think this also is something which makes it special and unique. Uh, so, and we try to offer it. And we're not sure yet in which direction the program will lead us because it's really new and we're still in the project phase and try to experiment a little bit, but um, till now um, it makes good progress. Because You have different audience everywhere, but some basics are always the same. I cannot actually talk about the difference between a Shanghainese audience and an audience, uh, for example, in Germany. I think there is not that much difference, um, and especially not in a, such a well-educated and rich society like Shanghai. So I wouldn't say that it differs that much from any other big city worldwide. <laughs>这个节目预告出来了，我敢来踩踩点，想看一下那果然是很不错，而且我觉得这个讲座前面的导赏呢，就是很有利于这个普及项目的展开。素质音乐厅这样的一个形式呢，使搭建了一个新的平台，这个
we still have to see which direction we're going to, but we wanted to make it a little bit broader and um, perhaps invite also someone who could play. Actually, in autumn, there will be parts of the Berlin Philharmonic here in <laughs> um, Shanghai. So we try to invite perhaps one or two people that she has as a guest here and to do some interaction, perhaps play also a little bit. We want to try to get the cultural scenes of China and Germany to stay in contact with each other and be a platform for discussion. <laughs> if you're interested in culture, especially music, and you don't have to go to Berlin, come to our small institute, listen and enjoy concert here. Looking forward to have you here.